Good Friday Eve, everybody. That sounds very energetically. Mm. I've just heard a bit of good news from Michelle. She just lost a whole pound. Mm -hmm. Are you chuffed, did? Nearly back to the weight that you was before we went on holiday. Me? I haven't weighed myself yet. I'm too scared. I'm going to weigh myself on Monday. It's Friday tomorrow. So today's Thursday. Yeah. All right. I have to. I've lost count. I have this feeling that it's on a... We've only just started work, but it's Thursday already. Which is weird. Because I feel miserable, but happy at the same time. If that's possible. Really strange. I think that's what you call teenage confusion. I think. Anyway, coffee got news to watch, news to forget, on to work. Speak to you shortly. And it's time to go to work. And the news today, a lot of the news today was about the football, which obviously starts tomorrow. The Euro, Euro Championships starts tomorrow. But the other story was about HIV positive children in Swaziland, which, yeah, we shall not say too much about that. It's not not a very good situation. Okay, time to go to work. Moving on. Let's start the day. Hi guys, we're at that car park again. Hey, one thing. Where Michelle works, directly opposite, there's an ambulance station. Hey, that ambulance has just come out of the ambulance station. Blues flashing, not the twos, it won't go bee 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 bee, whatever the noise it makes. Bee do bee do bee do bee do. What's the other minion? Anyway, minions on. Uh, I forgot what I was going to say now. Oh yeah, just come out all, all, all blue flashy lights. Be door, be door, be door. Race down the road and he stopped at the bottom. Turned all his lights off. Maybe we should check it make sure the lights work. That could have frightened a pedestrian. Into jumping in front of ambulance. Why would you jump in front of an ambulance? Because it's best for your club bit. You won't know we're buying. <laughs> Pick you up and carry you away. But then we're going to run over by a train because that might be going to Southampton and hospitals in Aberdeen. We do. We do. <laughs> anyway, time we're in a crust. Yep. Yes. Is the day keeping you awake? Yep. Onward and inward. I'm at my work. Terrific. Excuse me why I just pay attention and get around this band. I wouldn't like to die on the car park or in front of the car park. So everybody would know it was me and I would be embarrassed. Okay, I shall speak to you after the working day is done. And that's the working day over with. On the way to pick Michelle up. And like I said, it's been a hell of a long week so far. I know I've only, I've only worked three days and it feels like a month. But that's what you get for going on holiday and having a good time. Anyway, speak to you shortly. I'll go and pick Michelle up. And look who's got in the car. And she's been shopping. Mm -hmm. Did you get everything you wanted from the shop? Yeah, crisps and chocolate and chips and burgers that go in the microwave. Micro chips? No, oven chips. Oh, no. They all in that little bag there. Yep. So how's your day been? Good. Yours? Boring and long. Never mind. Friday tomorrow. I know. I just can't. I just can't get back into it. To the holiday. It's just dragging. Anyway, shall we get home? Yep. Any PLN for tonight? I'm just going to do some more cutting. Okay. Fabric, that is. Okay, doke. So, I've seen this, sunglasses. Yep. Anyway, onward. Okay, guys, that's it. Thursday night coming to an end. Got to get through the Friday working day, and then it's the weekend. Now, Michelle's had a change of style today. She's gone all black.
And she's also been reading a book. What are you reading? Outside in. Is that the sequel to Inside Out? By uh, Maria Schneider. What's that about? What was the Inside Out? It's all about this race of people and they're inside this place and they don't know what this place is and they're being controlled. And eventually they find out that they're on a spaceship. And then the book ends there and then outside in is where the people who are controlling the spaceship, which is taking them to another planet to repopulate, um, come to take it back. 